case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court of the United States has ruled in favor of the Commissioner of Internal Revenue in a 1967 case known as United States v. Correll, injecting clarity into the murky waters of tax law. At the heart of this controversy was a traveling salesman who claimed the cost of his daily breakfast and lunch as traveling expenses on his income tax returns. The Commissioner of Internal Revenue objected, arguing such deductions were not valid since the salesman's daily trips did not involve sleep or rest, essentially classifying his meals as personal expenses rather than travel expenses. The salesman didn't take this decision lying down. He sued for a refund, a decision that initially went in his favor in the district court, a verdict further affirmed by the Court of Appeals. This lower court decision, however, was challenged when the Supreme Court, taking cognizance of the controversy surrounding this sleep or rest rule, decided to grant certiorari, or a review of the lower court's decision. Upon review, the Supreme Court reversed the lower court's judgment, upholding the commissioner's interpretation of the statute on grounds of being reasonable and within his authority to implement congressional directives effectively. The Supreme Court squashed any suggestion of revising or perfecting the administration of tax laws, stating such tasks are squarely in the realm of the commissioner's mandate, not the court's. With this decision, the commissioner's sleep or rest rule was deemed valid, reinforcing its relevance and applicability. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.